Hi up there. Welcome to Leech News, episode 36. Things gonna get a little wild. Things gonna get a little out of control. But that's ultimately what we're here to do, right? Let's have fun with this. My only qualm is, why is RV Andy in the house? And Sam and Andy is not. RV Andy's in there doing whatever he wants while Sam and Andy is in a tent outside getting the cops called on him every six hours. <sighs> it's silly to me. But anyway, let's look at this nonsense. It's a trap blade. It's a trap blade. You cuss like a lady, buffet drama like a man. It's a trap, it's a trap, it's a trap. If you cuss like a lady, buffet drama like a man. It's a trap, it's a trap, it's a trap. Hey, Blade, we got a donation. Hi, Blade. My dad's our It's a very sad Can one. Can you please be quiet and dedicate 30 seconds to his favorite song? He wants a 30 second please silence. Please take off your hat. He wants to take off your hat. For a 30 second silence. <laughs> oh, look at the top of his head. <laughs> Y'all some, y'all some <laughs> fucked up boys. <laughs> yeah, they got, they got me. I love you guys. Alright, Blake. This is gonna be a hard one. That's four steps. <gasps> like a champ. Like a champ. <laughs> this one's seven steps. This is hard. Oh, Ooh, that's it. Ooh, <laughs> Blade. You got that. You got Oh. <laughs> Wow, amazing. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. This is a walk. Okay. This is how I walk, my little What would you take me for a first time? Just, just hang out in my room and do stuff. Look, there's a spider in your shirt. There's a spider in your shirt. Take it out. Take it out. No? Okay. <sighs> I don't want to tell the gorilla joke here in Europe. No, I will not. I will not tell the uh, joke in Europe. It's very bad. Okay, you, you you take a gorilla and a black man in a dark room. And then you take the hands in a box yeah. and then you put a spotlight over the boxes yeah. and then you have to tell me the difference between the hands. What is the difference? Yeah, yeah there is no difference. It's the same. They are the same. Oh my god, it's so bad. I'm trying to trying to boost up his ego, help him out, dude. Get him back into streaming. I, he's a good guy to me. He's been nice to me. But I'm trying to help him out, be a be a homie, not be like ah f off. You know, you're right. The chat. You know what I mean? Like help him out. What up? No, yeah, nonsense. <sighs> Flat pancakes wiggling all around. No. No, I didn't. I can smell it. No, I mean... You eat off the balcony and you admit it, so... No, I didn't. What the fuck is wrong with you? What the fuck is wrong with you, dude? I don't like this fucking shit that you talk to me about me being You native. peed off the balcony onto the floor. No, I didn't. Okay. Go, go fall my urine, man. Blake, you need to stop drinking. It's... You're fucking wasted right now. Yeah, I'm wasted, bro, but I didn't pee off the balcony, dude. Well, you did, because I fucking heard it. And it's orange, and I can smell it. That's okay, not, man, there's the balcony. That's not my pee, dude. There's the pee. That's not my pee. Honey. That's where you were standing. That's, pee, that's your pee. Go smell. Never... That is a lot of pee. 
tell you that right now. Smell it. Before. Smell the pee. Butler, can you please smell it? Oh, fuck. Can you tell me if that's pee? He's the, he's the, he's the slave it. shit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Lay. I can't smoke I know this what clean <laughs> this It's pee. Uh, in, introduce yourself. What's up? How you doing? Do you talk? Okay. All right. We surprised. That's cute. Okay, we snicker. Okay, that's cute. <laughs> Heavy breathing, okay. Oh, it's the, it's the dwarf, he's fine. He's not gonna show his dick. This is my friend, he's three feet tall. I did, this is how the song is. Where the fuck are you sitting? Press him, press him, Blade, press him. Now kiss him, kiss him, kiss him. The English language and the swear arms. Kiss, 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 kiss. Fight, 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 fight. She doesn't exist. She doesn't exist. PD, I would, I would, I would fucking. Several of this shit, but like, that's not what this is about. It's about good times. Hey, uh, hey, hey, false alarm. False alarm? Okay. Oh my. Pete, you look so happy to see you. Oh my gosh. You just can't understand a word he's saying, and that to me is just so hilarious. I know it's dumb comedy. I love dumb comedy, though. Oh my gosh! <laughs> you just, you just don't exist, man. Figure it out. What? False alarm. <laughs> what? Play? Come on, man. <laughs> Oh my goodness. I see why they keep you around. I pray you get that leg fixed though. My friend had something on his leg like that. But it was a tattoo that got all infected weird and then it got some like cancerous tumor on it. Didn't have to chop off his chop off his leg, but it made his leg look really nasty. And you can take care of it and take care of it and take care of it. It goes down and then it comes back. It goes down and then it comes back. You can't just let wounds fester, bro. Not a good idea. Blade, you're dying. I'm not dying. You're though, dying, bro. bro. I'm not dying, though, bro. But I'm about to, I'm about to fucking geyser her up, though, bro. I'm about to fuck. Where you be long by the weekend? <laughs> Have you heard my system? No, I, I, I put a bitch on. Like, Low bruises. <laughs> no, 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 nigga, no, listen. That is not the decision. Well, that's what I'm saying. Why, 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 why are you being all that? In the garage. Why are you being all that in the garage? Oh, I'll delete the Reddit. Oh, you can't delete the Reddit. Why you did that in the garage? Why you did that in the garage? I'll delete the Reddit. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh man, time to lighten the mood, people. Come on, man. <laughs> yeah, denim. 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 Shit. No, 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 no. If we play, where we live on by the weekend, <laughs> and it's sex on. Will you be right by the weekend? This is a sex song. The weekend is the artist. Will you be right? Is it a sex song? I, I don't get it. I'm, I've never heard a song by the weekend called Will You Be Right? Have you? Don't know of that song. Never heard of it. Hmm. No, that was going to be adorable. And then he had to go and say, don't touch me. Man. You ruined a very, very, very precious moment. Look at that face, too. He's so sad. So distraught. And Blade is all mad. Kind of blacked out, but... Just so, so mad. I'm making this guy so, so sad. The obnoxious paintball shooter guy. 
Poor guy. So, what, what, what were we doing? Just don't be a about it, dude. I know you want to be a fucking butler, but don't be fatty about it. Figure it out. Fat. Dude, I got a text speech right now, and you are not about that shit. Mm. Hey, bro, if, if I was a fat guy, no, you. What a sissy, dude. Brett, you sissy. Because you disagree with someone, you try to jack their stuff. Always being the idiot. Dude, you're worse than Hampton Brandon, dude. <sighs> the new Hampton Brandon, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my goodness. Why does it always gotta be like this? You are on speaker, you're on the stream. Say that then, peoples. I am coming to Kelly uh, March 4th for that interview. No one wants to see your, your flappy flat, flapjacks. No one wants to see that. You might as well be farting right now. <laughs> That's you right now. One thousand dollars donations, and you'll bring the Reddit back. All right, I love you. That was Keemstar. <sighs> what a dumb cloud chaser. He is. I will bring the Reddit back. I will be Ice Poseidon's man here. So it has to get one thousand retweets. Oh my gosh. If I get 1,000 retweets, then I will be Ice Poseidon's manager. I will bring the ready back. And I will make everything right again. I promise you guys, because I'm Keemstar. I'm Killer Keemstar. And I'm going to make everything better again. Because I'm the best at being better again. Check me out, guys. Do see signs, guys. Two fingers up in the air, guys. Do see signs, do see signs. Trying to bring the red back, guys. So you can be toxic again, guys. Because I'm Killer Keemstar and I hate Alex, guys. Uh, found a dollar in the woods, guys. No one's gonna get you guys. Check me out, guys. It's gonna be great. Okay. Um, so one of my favorite things to do uh, is I like to get really drunk and then go in my car and listen to music. Hey, Blade, there's a woman outside for you to have sex with. She's right outside that door right oh, there. Okay. She's getting hot. Alright. Oh, my goodness. You there? I'm trying to cram, bro. Yes. I'm famous, bitch. You ain't shit. Wait, can I hold this room for you? Can go ahead. Go ahead. All right, let's go. Let's go, Blaine. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Open it up. Open it up. <laughs> open it up. I'll open it. I'll open it for you. 
I swear to God, I'm gonna talk silly to this bitch. Talk silly to her. Get her. Get her, Blake. Get her. Get her. Have an ass. Order a salad. Shut the fuck up, bitch. I like freedom of speech, and I think that when people want to express their opinion, they. Alright, this guy's name on Discord is Peaceful Jihad. <sighs> and he's always talking over people, thinking only his opinion matters. It's very annoying. Very, very, very annoying. Fun to listen to. Because he just blabs on and 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 on. But it's all good though. Everyone has the right to stay, say what they have to say. Doesn't mean you have to listen to them, but it's all good. A good outlet to do it with. The Reddit didn't agree with you on everything, right? And that's fair game. But at the end of the day, they were just expressing their opinion on the stuff that you were doing. And when it comes to talking about like expressing their opinion, all that's gonna happen is they're just gonna go to the Discord and do the same thing here. And let's realize something also. We'll get to Peaceful Jihad's point in a minute. If you see on Ice Poseidon's far, I want to say left or right hand corner of the page, there is a Sam Pepper Discord still there. But it has the 50 unread messages thing on it. So that means that he hasn't checked it in a minute. And that's both a good and a bad sign. Maybe he still talks to Sam Pepper. Maybe he's just holding it in his heart that he needs to forgive Sam Pepper. I say bring him back. Now let's get back to this peaceful jihad uh, commentary. Huh? Like their opinions aren't going away. You just removed the platform for them to be able to do it. I don't like the Reddit personally, and I never posted on there. But I feel kind of like the people on there deserve the ability to be able to give you the criticism, even if it was, you know, toxic. If you get what I mean. Yeah, but why would I want? I agree with him on this particular, in this particular section of the conversation on this particular point. Keep it up, because look at the Discord. No one's allowed to post memes anyway. You said it's supposed to be there to post memes. Look, no one's posting memes. We're not allowed to. That was taken away. Obviously not for Ice Poseidon. He can still post memes, but everybody else? It's just words. It's just... Let me see this. Let me see that. You're not allowed to post memes because it goes too fast. With so many people active on it. And if you post memes, it goes way faster. Even with the seven second slow mode on or whatever it is. Because there's just way too many people active on it. So the experiment failed. Now it's time to introduce your scuffed Reddit. That's that. I say you have both. You have the Ice Poseidon subreddit and you have the Scuffed subreddit. On the, on the Scuffed one, you have these spe specific particular guidelines that you have to follow. If you don't, there are consequences. You can't just kick people off because they'll just start, start a new account with an alt. An alt, another alt, another alt, another alt. And that cycle just keep going. You have to find a way to lock those alts on a person. Maybe have someone write, a, write an algorithm for it so those people can be blocked from using other alts because those IPs will be traced back to them using the algorithm and They'll eventually 
have to ban all those alts with it, with it. Uh, they're banned if they continue on with that hateful behavior, the violent behavior, the doxing behavior. And put an end to it. Find someone that knows how to write code. I'm going to endorse that when it's actively bringing down my real life. I don't believe that you're endorsing it by simply allowing it to happen. But if I'm, a, mean, if I'm allowing something to happen that I advertise it's under my brand, then that's endorsing it. I, understand. I disagree. I understand the point, but I don't think that you're endorsing anything they're doing. And YouTube wants to make you do that, but they're wrong for doing that. They want to make you re solely responsible because they can't make them responsible because of the alts and all that. <sighs> You're not responsible for the mice. You're responsible for yourself. And this wouldn't be occurring if you were more active with those in your community and if you had a better dialogue with us and actually talk to those of us especially members and up you know have a nice dialogue with us join in a real conversation in regular vo on a regular voice channel get to know your community better and help people understand it's not okay to joke certain ways and then it's okay to joke other ways find better ways to joke help us understand the guidelines help us understand who you are more open yourself up a little bit more Yes, there's always going to be hate and crap, no matter what, no matter how many times you ban this, ban that, stop this, stop that, there's going to be hate, there's going to be crap. Yeah, no one likes that, of course. I think it's detrimental for the community. I think it's detrimental for Ice Poseidon's personal health and sanity. And I would advise you to stop doing that. I think it will be ultimately only detrimental for those who suffer for it. Once you set that example, it'll either slowly dwindle down or it'll just be completely cut off and no one will do it again, or it'll just keep continuing. Hopefully it will not. Hopefully people will learn their lessons, grow up a little bit, be a little more mature. I hope for for the for the best. Excuse me. I know people can change. You got to give people the, the benefit of the doubt sometimes. Help them grow. Help them learn. Help them adapt to real change. And that by having it associated with your name, this might be looking like you're endorsing it, but at the same time, I believe that when it's actually legitimate criticism by people who like and watch your stream, like, you can choose to ignore it. There Obviously, is legitimate. Obviously, the over-the-top stuff is more serious, like the hate threads about people and stuff is pretty bad in its own way, but at the same time, when you're talking about, like, people just expressing their opinions on the quality of your stream and whatnot, everything gets lumped in together when you take down the whole Reddit. But here's the thing. Like, it was with people expressing criticism towards me, that wasn't the reason why I ultimately privated the Reddit. The reason I ultimately privated it is because I don't want people who come around me to get criticism either. Um, if people want to criticize me, that's fine. I chose this shit, I get it. But people around me who aren't even streamers, they don't want to fucking be around me anymore because why the fuck would they want criticism? Then you don't need those people in your life and they're not your real friends or girlfriends or whatever. You don't need those people. You have to accept, and this is the key determining factor in every relationship and every friendship. You have to accept everything, every flaw, every good thing, every bad thing about a person to truly love them. Otherwise, you don't love them. You never did. You're using them. And that should be a determining factor of who's using you and who is not. That should be your gauge, I suppose.
It should be an advantage. It should be a good thing. To cut out those toxic people in your life who aren't there for you. They're not really real. They're not. A lot of girls are like that. They just want to ride that train and, you know, put on that whole innocent act, play the little charming person for the few first few whatever months, weeks, years, whatever. Sometimes days. If, you know, if they're really clear about how bad they clout chase, but. That should ultimately be a good thing, I suppose, I think. You need that constructive criticism in your life. You need that accountability. So you can, you know, learn and grow as a person and so others can learn and grow around you. Well, as both a person and a streamer. They didn't choose this shit. I understand that, you know, they don't yes, they did. but at the same time, if they choose to go on stream and at the same time as well, it's like they don't have to look at the Reddit and see these posts being made about them. Like, yeah, but people are getting dogs they don't have to, to be my, no one else. They, they don't, don't have to be my friend either. They could just not be my friend either. That's also easier. No, bro. You're deflecting. That was a deflection from Paul. No. You gotta learn to take some things with a grain of salt, like Ice Poseidon even says to, to those on stream and all that. You gotta learn to take with a grain of salt, but then those who aren't on stream don't get those rules. So you have to have some sort of disclaimer. With them personally, on your stream, on your Reddit. Just have like a disclaimer, just like at the beginning of those uh, stunt shows, like Travis Pastrana's uh, Nitro Circus, like Ben Margera and Johnny Knoxville and their show. I don't like saying the name of the show, but you know what show I'm referring to. Because it's a cuss word, and I don't like cuss words. It's the cuss word for donkey. Jack bleep. Anyways, you, you have that disclaimer right there. So everyone knows. As soon as you start every live stream, you should have the disclaimer that goes up. Warning. Everything in here is not all real life. Some of it is scripted. Warning, this may cause your real life a lot of harm, because some people don't know how to joke. Warning, the stunts and activities performed on this live stream may be detrimental to your health. Do not try this at home. Do not emulate me at home. This is age appropriate material. We're showing graphic content here. That is not for the weak of heart or for little children or for underage children. See what I'm, see what I'm getting at here? I think it would be a good idea to. Be more interactive with your community. Help us along. All right, let's end this off real quick. See what else they have left. Uh, here you go. Careful, I'm burning your fingers. No, 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 no. Oh, you're about to fucking eat the roach. Okay, never mind. Let's just not. Let's just not. Okay, all right. You want to lay down? Yeah. All right, come on. All right. Well, that does it. And I like I like I do like seeing RV Andy taking care of Blade, and he does that with a lot of people. He's very good about taking care of people. And he's a very responsible individual and a kind-hearted person. I think a lot of people should emulate that behavior. 
be better people all together. Well, this is Leech News, episode 36, Eugene on the same. Oh, this was very enlightening and probably pretty funny. I'm not sure how it translates to y'all out there, but I had a lot of fun. But it was funny. So y'all be kind to one another out there. Try and help each other be better people. Please challenge yourselves to be better people. It gets easier and easier as the more you do it, just like anything else. Just like quitting something. Just like building yourself up to be whoever you want to be. Takes a lot of thought, effort, time. But it'll be all worth it in the end. All right. I got nothing, 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 nothing but love for y'all. Even those who hate me. And I appreciate your constructive uh, criticism out there. I'll try to do better with the sound on the upcoming videos and I have my mic turned off on accident but I slouch, I'm sorry I like to be comfortable especially when filming these types of videos and uh, I hope y'all just bear with me if you don't like it, leave the dislike leave a uh, whatever kind of comment you want to leave ultimately it's your choice if you want to be here if you want to subscribe to me or unsubscribe or turn those notifications on, notifications, sorry, on and off and, uh, you know, watch these little weird, wild videos, whatever. All right. Yeah, have a good one. I pray nothing but blessings on your life. I pray you grow in everything you do. I pray you become better people. <sighs> All right. That was nice. Hmm.